Many of Cape Town's beaches are hidden away and there's some absolutely spectacular ones. I've been coming to the sun-drenched shores of the Western Cape for over 24 years and after a lot of research, here are my top five secret beaches of Cape Town. is Platboom Beach at the Cape of Good Hope in the Cape Point National Park. It's an absolutely stunning beach and if you're looking for a hidden beach in Cape Town, this is the place that I highly recommend. It's uncharted and wild, absolutely beautiful. Sand dunes everywhere and it's great if you want to go surfing and windsurfing. Cape Town is full of secret hidden beaches and I'm here in Simon's Town to discover a very special one called Water's Edge and I've come to what looks like a very ordinary garden gate but actually there's a secret beach just behind it so come with me. And here it is, Water's Edge. Who'd have known? <laughs> In the 1800s, this beach was owned by a house but it was actually given to the public after that and now in South Africa by law they're unable to take that back so it's public domain and it's an absolutely beautiful beach it's not quite so secret anymore but it really is a very stunning little place and definitely worth a visit Many of Cape Town's beaches are hidden away and I've come to a spectacular little spot which is about an hour and a half outside of Cape Town at the Langaban Lagoon. Now this particular beach is called Preakstool and it is stunning and during the week it is empty and you have a whole bay to yourself with turquoise water and it's warm that you can actually swim in. In Cape Town that is a rare prospect so I'm really happy to be here and behind me is the signature of this place which is this rock formation and this beach preach stool is actually named after the preacher's pulpit in Afrikaans beautiful beautiful place and a must come to when you come to Cape Town Wow if you'd have told me that I could sit in the sea like this in Cape Town I'd have told you you were crazy this is amazing and you can find deserted stretches all the way along this Langaban Lagoon. It's absolutely spectacular and I have to say, I think this is my favourite secret beach. Another secret beach is Dalebrook and this is on the Musenberg side of Cape Town. So there's a lot more sharks in the water here. But in this area they have these tidal pools which you can swim in and they fill up and they're much warmer than the Atlantic side. So you can actually get a good swim on this side of Cape Town. But it's a wonderful little secret beach that hardly anybody knows about. This is a fantastic little hidden beach and you actually have to walk underneath the train tracks here at Dalebrook to find it. Cape Town has some real gems of beaches that are hidden and slightly off the beaten track. This is another example which is called Sandy Bay and as you can see it's a little bit out of the way and you have to trek to the beach but once you get there it is absolutely beautiful and often there are not a lot of people there. 
Sandy Bay is situated between Camps Bay and Hout Bay and is near Landudno. It's a bit of a trek to the Long White Beach from the car park, but it is really worth the effort once you get there. And this is it, the beautiful expanse of Sandy Bay. Well worth the hike to get here, an absolutely hidden gem in Cape Town.